Well, new this morning, we are hearing from a woman who recently found her passion, built a business, and paid off her debts. She is now laying out her experience and offering advice in a new book. Julie Solomon has a new book deal, a successful business, and a podcast. But all of this did not come easily. I had a lot of mindset, a lot of limiting beliefs. I was a new mom in a new city by myself. I had a lot that I had to get to the other side of in order to really see what was possible. On top of that, she found herself in over $30,000 in debt, desperate to hide it from her family and fix it. The solutions were always outside of me. It was always going to be that person's responsibility or that thing or that idea would come in and kind of save me from myself. And so it kept me in this state of delusion and denial. Julie was finally forced to face her problem and find a solution. So I had to start really digging in. I had to, you know, I started to read a lot. I started to get help. I started going to therapy. I started, you know, calling on financial consultants and advisors and people that could really help me start to understand, at least on a conceptual level, how to show up as a boss, how to start managing my money, my finances, my forecasting, my time, my energy on top of being a mom. She ended up learning much more. She saw what she was capable of and passionate about. Coaching creators, small business owners, and anyone really who wants to own their brand and create something special. Julie started the Influencer Podcast. She created online courses and slowly but surely she got out of debt and found her purpose. And now she put that all in her book, Get What You Want. And that's what you find in the book. It's a step by step on figuring out what your purpose is, how to start using that purpose, how to really niche down and get clear on your goals and, and what you should focus on. And then the blueprint that I have in the book to help them step by step, start pitching themselves, getting themselves out there, negotiating for what they want, and then really building that network of community that they need for that long term support. How cool is that? So mm -hmm. fun fact, Julie and I went to college together. So it's awesome to see her, you know, killing Delighted. it now. I hate yeah. people like that. I yeah. know. I'm so proud of her. Like, the book is incredible. If you are looking for something, it's, it's good for men too, but she's really focusing on, on women and female entrepreneurs. It's available on Amazon. It was just released this week, and it's already a bestseller. And I'll I think tell you what my daughter said to me. What's that? Dad, I don't read. <laughs> well, they, they should read this book. No, that's great. Book. I'm so uh, proud congratulations of her. to everyone that kind of yeah. does, do, yeah. does that. It's mm -hmm. really kind Hold of Hold themselves up by their bootstraps, mm -hmm. find what they really want to do with their life, and then do it. Mm -hmm. Okay. We now